गुड मॉर्निंग एवरीबडी सो आई गॉट मेनी रिक्वेस्ट टू मेक वीडियोज ऑन एडमिन सो आई हैव कैटेगराइज दिस एडमिन इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर इन थ्री स्टेजेस वेर फर्स्ट वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द बेसिक क्वेश्चन विच इंटरव्यूअर मे आस्ट बट यू शुड नो दिस बेसिक क्वेश्चन नाउ सेकेंड वन इज द सिनारियो बेस्ड क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर where i have will give some uh, kind of scenarios and based on that we will get some answers from there and third one is a really uh, real time scenario questions and the tricky questions right which interviewer may ask based on the real time scenarios okay so first we are going to start with the basics question and uh, i would say that everyone should know this question and answers as per the basics because it's just a basic questions so in this we will just quickly check few almost 40 questions may be there part 1 and part 2 and in part 1 i will take 40 questions which will just refresh your things okay and uh, i think if you have more than 6 month of experience then you have to uh you have to give the answer of the those questions so let's start okay first so which is the best way to make the field mandatory for all so if suppose there are any field and i want to put it as a mandatory field so what all are the uh, options do you have and which one is the best so there are many options we have like field level security validation rule page layout page layout means on when you will edit the page you will get the option to read only or to edit is only so you can choose uh, means yes it's a read only or you need an input for it right so we do have two options then through the trigger we can put a dot get error method and we can throw the error and the fourth one is apex code through the apex code also you can validate the your uh, mandatory fields so the best answer is field level security so the field level security we can validate means we can put the mandatory very easily very comfortable okay now second question is in which edition you can create a managed package so see most of the companies are working in managed package It's internally they are going to create some kind of uh, managed package so this is the basic questions that they will ask okay in which edition so that's a developer edition okay third is which report can't be used to create group by a group of data or chart so it's a simple tabular report okay because in summary and matrix you will get a data to do the group by but in tabular it's a simple report now which of the following is not a compulsory field while creating a user record so a role right role is not a mandatory field okay whereas profile is a mandatory but role is not mandatory to give every users it's up to you if your organization follow the hierarchy then we can put the role in hierarchy or a role now so a uh, question number 5 a user successfully log in at 1 pm okay what happens at 131 if the login hour of the user's profile are set to 730 am to 130 pm so what's happen here so if user time is 730 am login time and logout time it is 130 pm and you, what happen if the time goes to 1.31 means 1 hour 31 pm what will happen so user is logged out so when he will try to do any operation right any dfl operation or doing any edit any change so you will get out from the salesforce org this is what happen and you will get this uh you will get this questions in interview so what will happen now question number 6 what is the impact of a user of org level local changes so it won't give any impact no impact will be there because 
local user has its own default everything right your system your org maybe it will be in us or uk or in australia or in europe anywhere in the world but if your local is set as an indian timing so it will all the fields will be work as per the local changes not as the organization level now apis are not present to use in which salesforce.com edition okay so apis you cannot use in professional edition okay it's 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 a default from salesforce okay so which question number 8 which feature is not present in salesforce.com so organization based login hour okay is not present in salesforce.com now question number 9 for how many days deleted record are kept in the recycle bin so suppose if you have an account object and there are 10 records and you have deleted one record so it will be in your recycle bin for next 15 hour 15 days okay after 15 days it will permanently delete from your recycle bin but if it is in your recycle bin so you can you can restore those data if you want okay now uh give try to give some uh, a standard profile name so like we have a standard profiles in in our salesforce so we have like read only solution manager system admin standard user so these all are the standard profile so they may ask you so tell me a few profile names default profile name and the custom profile you have to replicate this a standard profile and clone it then after you can create a custom profile so question number 11 which is not a standard salesforce.com application the service service is one of the uh cloud which is not a part of salesforce.com standard salesforce.com application question number 12 which field type cannot be used as an external id so pick list field okay pick list fields have some default values right so it cannot be an external id okay question number 13 what relationship can be selected in a custom report type where account is a primary object and contact is a related type so when you create a custom report type so you have to establish the relationship okay now if you don't know about the custom report type so you can go to the salesforce and in setup gear setup icon and in setup search box you can write report type so you will get the uh, link there and when you will click on it so you can you can just put some relationship between two objects so each account may or may not have a related contact so it is up to the records what we have okay now question number 14 what dashboard okay this word displays is correct incorrect but it's okay what dashboard component can be followed by user on chatter so it's a matrix with conditional highlight okay will be can which can be used now question number 15 when using sharing rule what record can be shared with so we can always share the record with the role and subordinates a role and internal subordinates okay because there are only two parameters that we can share the record based on the criteria and based on the record owner we are going to share the record records through the sharing rules okay so we can share with the role and internal subordinates or role and subordinates now so that's all for this basic questions so there might be 40 50 questions in basics so just have a review on it and please like share and subscribe the channel thank you